Hey guys, so I'm in Chicago right now um, on vacation and I thought I would show you guys what I packed in my travel makeup bag. Everything is in this clear plastic Temp2 airbrush uh, makeup bag. So I shoved everything in there and I probably won't be able to close it <laughs> while on my way to Europe, which we leave tomorrow. So the first thing I have with me is my flower palette. This is from Walmart. I got it on the uh, Christmas sale. Um, I think it only cost like $4.99 or $4 when it was on sale. Pretty good quality eyeshadows. Um, just wanted to experiment a lot with them more. My Tarte blush in Tipsy. And I can never go anywhere without this blush ever. I love it so much. And next we have the Lorac Pro palette number two. Um, honestly, the only color that I use a lot out of this palette, obviously, is Buff um, as an eyeshadow base, but I thought I could use some more colors while I'm here. I wanted to bring palettes with me that I haven't used in a while. Um, this one is new. This is the Lorac Unzipped palette, and the colors are so amazing and so pretty in this palette. I love them. And my Hard Candy Primer Shine Free. I'm almost out of this, so I don't know if I'll run out when I'm in Switzerland or not. Um, this is new. I was debating whether to show this in this video or not, because I was going to do a Chicago slash Switzerland haul. Um, but yeah, this is one of the products that I got from NYX. It is the Color Correcting Concealer Palette, and I used it today, and I really love it. And then my Stila in the Light Palette. Um, I haven't used this in a while, and ugh, I would really like to get more use out of it because the colors are really, really pretty. Um, another one is the new Wet n Wild um, Limited Edition Spring Collections. This one is in Vegan Culture. It's really pretty greens and blues. And this is another Wet n Wild one, Purples. My all-time favorite bronzer right now um, is the Physician's Formula one in SPF 20. So it just looks like that. And I really like that the bronzer has an SPF in it. My Tarte, uh, what is this called? Clean Slate Flawless Primer. I love um, the smell of this. And I have really oily skin, so I don't use a highlighter, which is why I like this primer, because it brightens up my face just a little bit, so I don't look like a complete grease ball. And then I got this NYX concealer in light, light pale. Um, and this was another purchase that I made over here in Chicago. And then I brought my e.l.f. contour and blush palette. I haven't used this in a really long time, like I'm talking probably about a year. And I think the top layer of it kind of dried out, but I've been wanting to use it. I used the bronzer today and I forgot really how pigmented it is, which is really nice. And my Sigma uh, Dual Eyeliner, I forgot which one this came with, I think this came with the Resort Palette. So I brought that with me. Um, my all-time favorite BB cream right now, or tinted moisturizer really, is by Flower Cosmetics, and you can get it at Walmart. I am the shade TM2, and I'm also almost out of this as well. A Milani blush in Dolce Pink. That's Dolce Pink. Really pretty shade. I really like it a lot. My Sonia Kashuk uh, Concealer Quad in Light. I use the orange shade for underneath my um, eyes to cover my eye bags. And then I set it with this light powder. Uh, next is my Kat Von D blush in... Uh, what was it called? Wish. Yeah, Wish. I love this color so much. I used to be really obsessed with it and use it all the time, and now I stopped using it, so that's why I brought it with me. And, oh my god, my original Lorac palette. Oh my god, look at this. Look how used this is right now. <laughs> um, I actually didn't use Slate that much, but I 
dropped it and slate broke. So that was really sad. Um, but yeah, this is my all-time favorite palette of all time, ever, in my life, as you can probably see. So I had to take this with me, of course. Um, this mascara I'm almost out of. It is the Flower Cosmetics Mascara. I got this also on sale. It came with one of the eyeshadow quads. Um, that was also on sale. Really good mascara. I do really like it. Um, it does clump up a little bit and it is starting to dry out now, but it's lasting me like three months, so it's about that time to throw it away. For fuller coverage, um, this is pretty much the only high-end foundation right now that I've tried that works with my oily skin, because I have super, super oily skin. And it is the Tarte Amazonian Clay Full Coverage Foundation, and I love it. Another Tarte blush, this is in, uh, I want to say Natural Beauty, I don't think it's Natural Beauty though, Blushing Bride. Blushing Bride. Yeah. Didn't use that much as often as I wanted to, so that's why I took it with me. My all-time favorite primer is my Lorac Pro Primer. Um, this is the second one that I'm using. The first one came with the original Lorac Pro palette, and I used that up. And then this one came with my Lorac Pro 2 palette, and I am almost done with it. But this is by far... If I had to purchase a full-size bottle of this, I would, because I love it so much. Actually, I have another, <laughs> I have another Lorac Pro Primer waiting for me at home. Um, this is the Josie, Josie Maron um, Black Oil Mascara. This came in the Lash Stash box that was on sale in Sephora for $45 during the Christmas time, and it came with like 10 mascaras, I want to say, and an uh, eye makeup remover. So it's good that I got this because I really wanted to try out different products, and yeah, so once flower is done, I will be using this one. Next is my Wet n Wild palette in Vintage Collection. No, Vinyl Collection. Oh crap. I put the wrong name on my Instagram then. Um, this palette is amazing. It's $3.39 at Walgreens, and it is just so so amazing and I used it today and I love it so much anybody who is thinking about getting it I would highly recommend it it's three dollars and 39 cents I mean you're not gonna go wrong there and if you don't like it just return it but yeah um, wipe off my hands Another Tarte blush, this is in Natural Beauty. This is really pigmented and gives a really nice flush on the cheeks. I love this color. Definitely my my most used um, Tarte blush is the Tipsy one. Um, a little Kat Von D eyeliner pencil that I got in an eye kit. I'm trying to use up all my eyeliner pencils because I have so many of them. My Tarte uh, Maracuja Concealer, this is in light. Um, this is the Tarte Brazilian's Tanner, Self Tanner. Yeah, I got a little free sample of this when I put in my Tarte order, and I plan on using it when I'm in Europe. And last but not least, my little bottle of the Bare Minerals, like, 5-in-1 eyeshadow base thing, cream. And it is a brown taupey color. So that is pretty much it. That is my whole stash. Um, I'm going to have to limit what I take with me to Europe. And I'm probably going to buy more makeup over there. Well, maybe not because everything in Switzerland is really expensive. It's ridiculous. But yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and saw some new products. And thank you for watching. Bye.